what's good youtube it's your boy bugs back yo guys what's good um yo yesterday's video did mad well guys thank you for coming out showing support guys we're getting really close to 100 likes bro we have, the last couple of videos i've been posting you guys have been showing mad support if you're watching this bro go drop a comment like the vid sub you're new for a chance of winning 10k stubs or a 10 dollar psn card all you guys gotta do just comment like it guys let's go 100 likes again we're getting closer and closer to 100 likes listen the support has been unreal why can't you guys just keep it up today's a nice simple uh vid it's about market overview i'm gonna tell you what's going on with the auction what you should do um how to make stubs i guess you should say and what's going up in value um it's pretty much it um pro we'll probably be streaming tomorrow at about nine eastern time so pull up to the stream tomorrow i got work all day i've worked the whole week so it's gonna be a little grind um it's gonna be hard for me to get out two videos a day i'm gonna try really hard to but it's gonna it's a grind um i don't know if player of the month cards come out this week but we'll see um anyways guys let's get into the auction um if you guys don't follow my twitch my twitter my instagram it's all in the dms just go drop the follow um yeah guys we're chilling today um everybody actually did go up a little bit just a little bit um pr prices are gonna rise as the days goes on what i'm hoping for mlb to do right now is drop a stub sale and save everybody because oh man i have so many players to sell and seeing them at this price is so upsetting um so anyways let's get into it um first off actually no before we even get into the market i want to see what they're dropping next week let's see if they did anything they have fourth inning content whoa, 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 whoa what's this hold on let me move this face cam real quick oh my goodness all right so we got we got split squad all-star event fourth inning content we got moonshot all-star event and an adam wainwright i don't oh okay that's new i didn't even see that so they have a new wainwright challenge so what i'm seeing is absolutely nothing is coming out that catches my eye so okay this is what's gonna happen let's let's put the face cam back on so with nothing on this list over here this is interesting now when is the all-star game um exactly i don't know it should what is the all-star game let me look it up mlb all-star game um hmm. uh seven nine okay all right so today's the 30th so about next week's the all-star game so this is what's gonna happen uh, this is what i'm thinking next week um there's gonna be a lot a lot there's probably gonna drop a huge all-star content like crazy all-star content but honestly i feel like they might drop a stub sale with the all-star content they haven't dropped a stub sale in like almost a month now but dude if they drop all-star content some crazy stuff's gonna go down we're gonna make stubs you have to sell all your players there's gonna be a different ways to make stubs we're gonna get into that obviously next week but anyways let's get into the market this week they're not dropping anything it doesn't look like what that means is yo so mlb clearly noticed that there'll be a huge market crash with them dropping nothing they'll probably drop headliners friday with them dropping nothing we literally could be golden this could be very very good news um let's just get into the market though so what i noticed off the bat joe Votto went up 10k already so keith hernandez went up 2k nothing a lot but these 40k packs bro you only get one they're gonna rise they're gonna rise they're gonna rise unless they drop them again which would ruin my day anyways we're just gonna go over everybody's price i'm gonna tell you who went up and went down so cal ripkin went up 4k he was 70k 69k he went up a little bit gary carter um george brett went uh went up a little bit gary carter went up a little bit when gary carter dropped he was about 110 he's at 136 now um we got brett by i still don't know how to say his name okay listen if you guys know how to say it in the comments drop it in the comments i still don't know how to say his name he did go up as well this matt williams was literally 80k he's a 98 overall look at those stats i'll probably pick it up this card pedroia went up 10k he was 50k and now he's at 63k so listen told you guys to pick up a bunch of 99s and stuff and right off the bat everything went up oh my god look at that <laughs> everything went up a lot wade boggs my subs were saying they got him for 50k he's at 60 um mccutcheon's up a little bit keith hernandez went up 3k he was 19k sell now 16k he went up a little bit yo this keith hernandez car is interesting this car reminds me of daniel murphy's car but better with really good fielding and better speed um this card is very good for 20k 
Um, yeah, as a Mets fan, your boy Bugs got to pick him up, man. I'm a big fan of Keith. Uh, he's a beast, man. So good. Um, let's see. This Eric Gain, I'm not even going to talk about him. At that price, just don't. Just stop. Um, we got Inno Slaughter. He's about the same price. We got, uh, let's see. I want to check Lou Brock. Lou Brock on a 4K, but dude, I lost too many stubs off him. Let's check Upton. Mad people have Upton. I know a lot of my subs have Upton. Russell Martin went up a little bit. He went up about 4K. Um, Jimmy Fox is still really cheap. Um, yeah, I'll be buying that. I oh wait, no, I have Russell Martin. That price gap's really good. If you're watching this video, go pick them up. That price gap's insanity. Uh, hopefully we get that car. I only have 12k stubs now. This Brian McCann has dropped 50k. He was 120, 110ish, 20ish k about what Wednesday, thir Tuesday. Um, yeah. Everybody. Okay, Upton went up a little bit. Ah, uh, dude, this Upton car was at 50k. He's at 55k. Yo, this car when I got him was at 70k. I lost a ton of stubs, bro. It sucks. They dropped content like that out of nowhere. Um, we got Vlad Jr. went down a lot. Did go up a little bit though. He was about 70k. Now he's 75k. So guys, with that said, as you can see, the auction is slowly reviving. Oh, this Travis Hafner is a beast. Oh my god. Anyways, this auction is reviving like crazy. Um, it's going up. It's going up. It's going up. Let's just pray that it just keeps going up. That's all we could hope for. Um, with all, if you didn't sell your cards, you got screwed up on this like I did. Um, all these players right here are so cheap. Listen, for the people who have only like 100k stubs saved up right now, 50k stubs, focus on these 93s. This Whitney Ford for 9k, this Joe Torrey for 15k. You want to literally pick up these cards because the auction keeps going up and it'll keep going up. Um, Bro, Yelich is still about the same price. What I notice is a lot of the legends went down, and a lot of the common players went down a little bit, but not as much as they should have. So, look. Look at this dude. I lost stubs on him, too. Oh, my goodness. So, all these cards are really freaking cheap right now. I'm not even going to lie. This is a good time to honestly kind of still pick them up and then sell them because we still have a long time till new headliners come out. Unless they drop them early and nobody knows about it, that would suck. That would kill, my, that would kill me. If they drop headliners on Tuesday... The market's going to crash again. That's the scary part. They have to drop headliners Friday. Just remember that. If you're listening to me and you're doing what I'm telling you to do, if they drop headliners on Tuesday, it's not my fault if you lose stubs. That's all I'm going to say because they've done it before. It's risky as hell. I'm, it's a little scary because they did it last week and they screwed me. Or what was it? Wednesday, Tuesday? I don't know. They did it last week and they ruined my day. Ruined my day. But anyways, let's look at some cop. Uh, let's look at some Machados because I told you guys to pick up Machado. So let's get into it. Uh, Manny Machado is let's see, 31k. All right, did go up a little bit. He got upgraded. Now let me tell you, I go to you guys to pick him up at about 30k, 29k. Listen, we're gonna lose stubs now. I have 3k. I'm waiting. Listen, the market is still low. It is still time to buy. If you have stubs, if you have any stubs, just go ahead and buy. People will rise over time. Machado is a prime example. Also, buy is a prime example. I use these cards in almost every aftermath of the market crash. This is where my stubs come from. All my stubs usually come from Baez, Chris Bryant, and Machado. Why? I see their prices go up and down a lot, especially on headliner days. These Those three cards always, always go up. I mean, go down on headliners. I get them. For cheap because they're people can get them out of the headliner packs i get them for cheap and then i flip them asap i make those quick stubs i make those stubs like i'll say i sell all my cards monday but right now i'm still waiting for instance i have chris bryant's i got all my chris bryant's for around like 15k he's at 17 like right now it's still low like you have to remember that you're like yo your boy bugs is a fraudulent bro he's he doesn't make stubs yo bryce harper got downgraded wow but anyways Chris Bryant, 17K, pretty good for ice. Uh, if you get it for 14.7, even better price. Just listen, listen to my methods. I actually want to check Okuna. Let's see how cheap he is. If he's 5K, I'm going to pick up more. Oh my God. All right, so 5,300 for Okuna. He's probably going to get upgraded again. If you guys could, go pick him up. And mm, let me think, Pete Alonzo. I want to check his price as well. He had another homer, 1,300. Oh my God. Yo, I think he might go diamond this year. I'm not even kidding. If he goes diamond be awesome for Mets fans oh yo this card yesterday was 16k 13k he was so cheap yesterday if you guys got him he went up to 20k 
Um, I, I noticed that yesterday. The Pete Alonso diamond went up a lot. And anyways, guys, that's all I got for you. Um, just be sure to buy. Um, be sure to pull up the stream tomorrow. Hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one. Pull up to the vids. Like the vids. Sub if you're new. And that's all I got. Closing on 12 this week. Oh, oh.